What's up, YouTube? And welcome to another Crib Zone excursion. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. Subscribe for more. We're getting away from the city. Mountains are the most beautiful scenery to ride along. This same street I'm taking you guys was where I learned how to do wheelies on the DRZ. For sure be Crypto's longest run. I'll get back to you guys in a bit. Ah, the wind is out against me. I'm on a bike here. And Crypto seems like he's about to hit the VTEC. So, hey, first time he's gonna see cows. Today's video, I'm gonna give you guys some tips on how to bike ride with your dog. This is a husky owner's worst nightmare. Going through a path filled with squirrels. When everything was green, there was a bunch of cows. They probably corralled their asses already. He saw a goat for the first time and he's tripping balls. He literally switched lanes on me. What is that? Look at that goat, it's teasing him. <laughs> Let's go. Come on. First time Crypto sees a damn sheep. This can't be a bike video without the portable dog bowl. I've never came here without a motor under me. This might be really hard to get up. I don't know. A good sign that your dog's really tired is that he's breathing two times in one stroke. <laughs> He's breathing two times when he should be breathing just one. Really good sign that your dog probably needs a break. Give him some water. If your dog doesn't really like to run, you have to get your dog in shape. You need to be fit enough to actually run. All right, guys, we made it to the path we have to take. Oh yeah, not everything in life comes easy. Always chase your dreams. If you wanna narrate dolphins eating a bunch of fish in a circle, narrate it and master narrating that. Whatever your passion is in life, you should pursue it 110%. Where should I ride? I would always recommend riding with your dog where there's little traffic. Since you do have someone's life in danger, you should always try to be extra careful. Check both ways before crossing a street twice. Make sure there's no cars coming before every intersection slow down make sure you're going fast enough where you can break in every situation scan ahead for traffic if a car's tires are moving heads up that means the car is moving never trust a cager or a biker look at me for instance i'm riding in the middle of the street with my dog so never trust a cager or a biker buy a harness if your dog doesn't own a harness you could run him with the collar but your dog will most likely be pulling in the beginning. That $14 harness has came in clutch. Before you hop on your bike, make sure your bike's in proper condition. Lube the chain, check the tire pressure. If you will be riding on pavement, a harder tire is always better. If you will be riding on rocks or sand, you want your tire to have less air, having lower tire pressure. If you don't own a bike, check your local Craigslist. Look around, you could probably find one for around $40. When you're first starting to bike ride, your dog will be switching lanes, crossing you over like LeBron James. After you correct that behavior, smack him if you have to. Make it clear it's not all right to switch. If you're riding next to traffic, Always have your dog the inside of the pavement. You don't want him to make any sudden movements and get his head chopped off by a car. I wanna let you guys know that I opened a Patreon account. If you guys haven't heard about Patreon, it's a website like YouTube. A creator such as myself can get paid directly from an audience such as yourself. Patreon could be extremely beneficial to my channel. If you guys were to donate a dollar, our Patreon goal is $500. As we start getting closer to the goal, we'll be updating the website, adding more features. It's gonna be serving as a VIP service for KZE production. Since you guys are directly helping out my channel financially, you guys will have all complete access to my channel. If you guys want a video request, that's not absurd. You help financially create a video in about two months. We are planning a camp trip, planning to take crypto camping. If you guys would like to donate to the channel, it could be $1, it could be $5. YouTube is a free app. All my videos will remain here. I will keep uploading videos. All my Patreons 
will be contributing to the channel's growth significantly. So I would like to thank all of you guys in advance. Patreon's a really good way to determine who your real supporters are. I'll throw the Patreon link down in the description. Help this channel grow. Help reach the goal of $500. All the money will be put back into the channel. As for shirts, guys, the shirts are now up for sale. I'll throw a picture right here. Boom! Different types of shirts you guys can buy. There's the premium one. The cheapest one is this one right here. Fruit of the Loom shirt. You could change the color. You can make the shirt whatever color you want. I like this blue one right here. If you want a pink one, there are shirts for women. 26% women. Shout out all my ladies. Is that my fucking dog? As for the size, there is a size chart. Scroll down, look at the size, measure yourself. All you'll have to measure is your chest and the length all the way to your hip. Shirts are now live. I do have a 15% discount code. I will be buying some so I could personally sell some here locally. Go buy that KZE shirt. Let me know what you guys think. The shirts will only be for a limited time. Finally decided what design to make them. Hope you guys enjoy it. Take advantage of that discount code. This has been way too much for one little soul. Holy shit! I wasn't recording. Fuck! According to Google Maps, this dog has ran 18 miles with just three stops, this being the longest one. Like always guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up, subscribe for more. Peace.